Hello there, and uh, welcome to the Forge of Mars, and we have another Dystopian Wars unboxing video for you. So we have here, uh, it was been sent out by War Cradle Studios, thank you very much, the uh, Independence Battle Fleet set uh, for the Union action within the game. So within this box, we've got all this awesomeness. So the Independence uh, Battle Cruiser, which could also be built as the Liberty, the America, and the uh, Frontier, which is a combination of uh, the Union bunker platform. Uh, we also have uh, these guys here, um, which are going to be the uh, sort of Lexington, Intrepid, and Reliant variants of um, that particular ship. Uh, which is the Gettysburg Heavy Monitor. Um, and that's the Yorktown, sorry. Pardon me. Um, so you've also got the Roanoke Strike Carrier Cruiser, which can then be built as the Montgomery, the Washington, Discovery, or California. I think most people are interested in this little fella, the Vitruvian Colossus. <laughs> because it just looks absolutely badass, a flying sea-based robot. Uh, what could you ask for more? Um, <laughs> the Cheyenne, although it's like the smallest, but it's very small, very sleek. Um, I, I really like the look of it. <laughs> As a proper hunter submarine that has that proper lethal sort of look to it. Um, we've also got in here the Springfield Corvettes. We've also got the uh, Farragut uh, frigates here. Um, these interest me, the escorts, because with certain capital ships, you can actually have escorts as an eight point upgrade. Now there are actually models for them. Um, so that's rather interesting, I thought. The um, <coughs> RC-52 Patriot Automata which again, little flying dudes uh, to uh, add to the mix, as well as the uh, Acrons at the top there. But um, for a Battlefleet box set, this is actually packed with kit. So, and as always, I love this box. <laughs> Absolutely love it. So the independence itself is resin. So we have the three different platforms. So yeah, so it's one piece. Everything is there, clean and crisp as always, with uh, these particular kits, which is always nice. Um, so that's your independence will go on to there obviously these would be from the um uh, the frontier so where you would normally have either your generators or or whatever uh cannons on the side here weapon systems uh these would sit in place on top of this and then obviously the carrier version as well which is the um liberty um so yeah that's uh, three different, well, four variants on the on the same chassis. So the basic, the different to the America and the uh, Independence are similar, just different weapons loaded out by lots of things. Um, but yeah, all clean, crisp, nothing at all wrong with them. Uh, SRS, so you've got Seven in each pack, so 14 in total. Standard bases. So, uh, so yes. Oh, look, the little frigate. They're oh, not frigates, little escorts. They're just one piece. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> um, <laughs> this is... All right, okay. So... Oh, oh, so it would appear that we have 
four different sprues, which makes a big, big change from what I'm used to because the last two unboxing videos with the uh, Jean Madeo and the uh, Thule, they were basically just six sprues. And yeah, you overused four sprues to make the big sort of mothership uh, or the main battle, uh, the Sky Bastion, uh, Sky Fortress, sorry. Um, but these have all got different, oh, look at that, the Cheyenne. I really, I really like that. And the, the, the platform, bug platform, and there's Vitruvian parts, Escort, oh, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It says we only get two escorts, but there's one there. So there's three escorts in this box. The box did a flyeth. There's no more on her, is there? No. So obviously there's your um, uh, carrier, the uh, Yorktown carrier SRS tokens. So you've got, oh, oh dear, 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 dear. I say dear, dear, dear. So we've got four SRS tokens in here where we're only meant to have three it's stating we've got two of the Talon tokens and should only be one SRS but we have two SRS so bonus we've got more parts in this kit I'm liking this even more now um, so yes we've not only got we get this out of the easier so we have the main battle cruiser we have the Vitruvian four flying units okay we now have three escorts as opposed to two which it says there we've also got two srs as well as two talon which yeah so talon there um the roanoke farragut Uh, yeah, so I can't actually identify these because these are the first time I've ever seen these actual kits, so <laughs> I do apologize. But we definitely got two of the Akrons because they're there and there. So, yeah, so we are, do in fact actually get an extra SRS and an extra um, escort token in this box, so definitely, definitely more value for money than expected. Um, we've also got the um, parts for yeah, so that, um, they're going on to go onto that because they're a little hover floaty dude. But yes, this is even better than I thought. Could have had two Cheyennes though. I love I love that look at that sub sub hunter proper sub hunter. But the looks of things. So yeah, oh, there's the hammer, the hammer. Or the Vitruvian. And uh, yeah, this all pops in together as always. Nice and snugly. <laughs> it's the simple things in life. But yes, that's a really, really, really good kit. Uh, a really nice selection of parts. And we've also discovered we've got extra parts in there as well. So what's not to like? If I OCD my way through this and replace everything into the box. So, because I'll get round to that when I have the next opportunity to actually do some painting and hobby. So I just wanted to get this little video out for everyone to enjoy and to see what we get in this most wonderful kit. And I love these boxes. Every time I open this up, it's just like, oh, this is like some sort of executive gaming system. <laughs>
But anyway, so that was the uh, Independence Battle Fleet set. Um, yeah, definitely, definitely good value for money there. If you're a Union player, lots of options as well. Um, like four different options for uh, a capital ship is always good as well, uh, which will be easy to sort of magnetize or or even just you know, pop into position. Uh, you can't really go too far wrong with that one. So yes, I hope you've enjoyed the video. Give a, a, a like uh, if you can, that'd be much appreciated. And uh, until next time, take care and happy sailing. Bye.